helpful and you enjoy the video but please let me know in the comment section what you think about these five trends that i have listed out you guys so i think i made you like this before in the past but i thought to like you know bring out another video because the trend is kind of everywhere i don't want us to get carried away because this channel is all about you know keeping it simple classic and you know try to shop less and shop more in your wardrobe the only way you can shop more in your wardrobe is when you have items that are classic and that you really do love okay that doesn't mean that you know trendy item would not get away in your wardrobe but you want to like think twice be very careful before jumping on any trend if it suits your style go for it five trends that i'll be discussing today that i think are one on my list here that is the denim skirt the denim maxi skirt is everywhere everywhere like everywhere you go in store the name trench the name you know skirt top crop top shirt everything is just all about the so this is a trend that i love at the same time that i hate because denim for me i think it is classy when it's kind of denim oversized trouser like baggy trouser i don't really have a problem with it i don't just really know but when it comes to the skirt i do it all depends on your style and what really work for you so i think that will determine how you jump into this trend the denim skirt is fabulous like i said before but i don't really think they are the most flattering or they are the most versatile piece i don't really think you can get away out of this skirt when the weather is kind of very warm because um, it's a very long skirt very heavy so instead of going for the denim skirt like the the classic denim color that we are seeing everywhere i would rather go for the cream like off-white i think it is more clean it's kind of very elegant and it's something that i would definitely get a lot of weight out of for very versatile because trust me off-white goes with everything in your wardrobe you can dress up you can dress it down it just gives you that kind of freshness kind of uplift your look it's trendy everybody's just looking the same everybody's just wearing the same thing you know i don't really so guys let's talk about the next thing on my list here it is oversized very big bag i think okay this is a trend that i love and hate at the same time because yeah when a bag is too big sometimes i don't know what you can fit into it because you can put everything inside of it but still it's as if there is nothing inside work for some people if you work maybe in an office you get to like take a lot of items around or maybe you are in nursing mom obviously you need all the you need a very big bag to kind of fit in everything that you need for your day-to-day -day life if you're going out so it all depends on your lifestyle that will determine if this trend will work for you these bags are just kind of too too big like out of this world a big bag can be okay but most of the time you get to get a little bit of wear out of it because you can only use them maybe to walk or if you're a nursing mom or if you think when you purchase items like this you want to like get the most wear out of it so i'm going for the oversized bigger bag i'm just going to put a picture maybe on this side the one that i think they are a very good option in case you want to like jump on the trend and the ones that i think they are like a no-no for me so hopefully you get a little bit of idea in case you want to like purchase any of these items and if it's item that you are not sure but you're just carried away by the trend i would definitely advise do not spend so much money on trendy stuff okay this is my rule don't spend so much money or go for like designer high hand brand for trendy stuff because it is trendy you're seeing it everywhere you might get carried away jump into the trend after spending so much money on item that is trendy after the trend what then happen okay it doesn't really make sense Let's, the next so the next one on my list here i think i made a video about it one month ago how to start a ballet flat i'm going to put the thumbnail here in case you want to get more idea like a little bit of inspiration then have a video i'll put it on here for you guys to see it has been trendy it is something that is kind of very classy a lot of people don't even like using high heel because trust me sometimes it can be very uncomfortable depends on you know if you if you're the type that work in a, in a sector whereby you have to like stand almost all hours of the day you don't really need high heel because trust me your feet at the end of the day you get to need so a ballet flat, I would say it's something that I genuinely love. I really love. Instead of sneakers, I prefer body flat. But it all depends on my outfit. But most times I get to use body flat because I just really think it really make you your outfit look a little bit more elegant, a bit refined, and add a little bit of that feminine touch to your outfit. That is one thing that I love about body flat. Very trendy. You can never go wrong with a body flat because. It is very comfortable, very easy to lifestyle with tons of items in your wardrobe. They are not selective. Okay, 
you want to like take notes when you're going for these kind of shoes sometimes it is very easy to make a very silly mistake that will read your outfit that is not what we want so when you're going for ballet flat i think it is always nice for you to go for the ones that has a little bit of more pointed toe because when you go for those ones that has round toe it just kind of cuts your feet and make your feet look a little bit more shorter it doesn't give that kind of nice feet that we want go for something a little bit pointed or more pointed depends on your feet okay why i said depends on your feet because if you have a very long or big feet like me you don't want to do a ballet flat that is too pointed because your feet is just going to be too way too long and that is not what i want something slightly pointed something not too much will definitely fit it and give you that kind of long legs very feminine and very chic obviously very very comfortable so guys these are items that in case you're sure of it you can invest in ballet flat because i think they are not trendy but they are never out of style even if uh there's something that we don't get to see so well but this year we're going to see a lot of ballet flats everywhere some people those that love it like me i have a video for you guys in case you want to get more inspiration i'll put it down here let's talk about the top of my list here metallic okay metallic trouser skates jacket top guys it is crazy to like you know follow trend when you want to like follow trend trust me guys it will consume your time your energy your pocket will suffer for it because you keep buying you keep buying there's something always trending more than one guys trust me if you want to like keep your wardrobe safe don't follow trend that's just the, that's just the trick for you to like keep your wardrobe safe love the item that you have in your wardrobe when you follow trendy item trust me mm, you're going to end up having tons of items but sometimes you don't know what to wear but you have lots of things there but you don't know what to wear especially when they are out of trend it becomes something that okay i don't like them anymore so keep your wardrobe safe by going for classic piece it will really help so guys metallic trouser jacket as i would really love this trend that i choose to rock this trend is for is going for like metallic shoe i'm going to show you guys some of the ones that i had before many years ago before the trend of these heels because these are something that we definitely reach out for because if you want to like maybe go out in the evening something to like help dress up your outfit instead of going for like a metallic um pants from zara from every it's just all over the place but i really think that these are items that you will really get out of wearing after some time because yeah they are not classic at all they are just trendy some trends can be fun to like add to your wardrobe but you want to like be very careful go for those pieces that uh that's that are going to be versatile easy to like style but yeah talking about the metallic trend i really think that it is more of like the sequence but in another way like younger brother or sister to like sequence because when you i think last year it was all about sequence you know trending last winter as well but now it has kind of switched to like the metallic trouser metallic skirt so yeah i would rather go for like a metallic heels or like a body flat instead of anything metallic like I'm ready to wear because these are items that I know I will not wear even on trade or after trade because there are some items that I just they are not they are just not for me. So that I'm gonna be talking about is the color of the year because nobody is kind of talking about the color of the year because there is nothing like color of this year. I've seen a lot of like the pink of last year because when it comes to color of the year most of the time it is kind of last year last year it was all about green last year two years ago it was all about green different shade of green but last year from this year it's still the kind of valentino kind of thing that is kind of trendy but it's not as trending as the denim maxi skirt and everything because it's just all about the skirt because i think a lot of people everyone is just kind of focusing on the denim trend instead of the color nobody's even talking about the color of the year because, because last year is all about the valentino kind of pink this year i think the master skates kind of take over two years ago it was all about the green different shade so yeah guys hope you enjoy watching i hope you find this video a little bit helpful so if you do please make sure to subscribe to the channel once more and like the video if you enjoy watching hopefully you find it helpful see you all in my next one thank you so much guys